Heart ridership is up and setting records. In fact, bus ridership in March 2012 set the all-time heart record of 1.3 million. That means the Hart family is growing and we can all help in keeping everyone's trip pleasant and buses running on time. Driving seven different routes split among his weekday and weekend shifts, bus operator Jason Eames is on the front lines of it all and knows firsthand how much precious time is saved if everyone simply knows the rules of riding Hart. Okay, well I've been working for Hart for about a year and a half now. Uh, I've definitely seen an increase in the ridership since I've started. Uh, some routes are busier than they used to be. Uh, other routes are just getting much, much more uh, busier than they were before. So definitely seen an increase. And the demographics have definitely seemed to have changed. You definitely see more students, more younger people, more young professionals getting on the bus. Knowing the different tips and tricks as far as riding a bus definitely saves time. Those few precious seconds, they add up. When you're doing a route that is 50 minutes, like the Route 2, those few seconds at every stop, you're adding up, you're adding about 10 to 15 minutes to the route sometimes, maybe even more. I've actually measured it. If an individual who has their, their uh, fare ready, if it's just one person, it takes about three seconds to open the door, board them, and take off again. Somebody who doesn't have their fare ready can take another 10 to 15 seconds for them to search for their fare card. If they don't know where it is, you're looking at another 30 to 45 seconds. So, I mean, it increases exponentially depending on the individual. In fact, Three million dollars could be saved every year if Hart could trim five minutes from its schedules on all of its daily bus runs. Those are savings that could potentially be reinvested for even more service to meet the demand. Speeding up boarding and deboarding benefits everyone and that's why Hart has launched Ride Hart and Be Smart. The messages are simple, but they inspire a communal sense of responsibility. This campaign kicks off in June and will be widespread as advertisements on our buses and bus stop shelters. And more than an estimated 50% of Hillsborough County will notice, ride hard, be smart. Operator Eames walks us through some of these important tips. First, have exact change ready. Having your fare ready definitely saves us a lot of time. When somebody has their fare card ready, it takes a matter of just swiping the card like that and sitting down. That took about one second. So from the point the time the person uh, boards the bus, swipes their card and sits down, we're looking at about three seconds. When somebody, somebody is shuffling through their pockets to find their card, you're looking at about 10 seconds. If they're paying with cash, that takes another five to 10 seconds to look to put all the cash in the machine, assuming that it's flat and you don't jam up the fare box and the fare card has to print and then they sit down. And just having to say all of that, you know, takes a long time. You can imagine how long it takes to actually do it. Second, keep your bus clean. Stop requested. Once you pull the stop request cord to get off the bus, make sure you gather all your personal belongings and take them with you. If you have any garbage, please gather it up and throw it away and you exit the bus as a respect for other passengers and the bus driver. By doing this, you can have all your stuff ready to go and be off the bus in less time than it takes to actually board the bus. So therefore, the bus can keep rolling and save time. Third, exit rear door. As we're approaching your stop for time efficiency, it's better for you to exit through the back door than through the front door because as we're boarding passengers through the front door and you're trying to exit through the front door, it creates a backup, a heart's little old malfunction junction. Now, if you are elderly or you have a, uh, a disability of some kind that prevents you from stepping down from this height safely, then you definitely want to exit the front door for your own safety. The three things to remember to keep the bus on schedule is have your fare card ready, have your stuff ready to go when you get ready to get off the bus, and exit through the rear door so that way people can board through the front. But most important, make sure you're at the bus stop on time. Make sure you have all your stuff ready, shoulders folded, grocery carts folded, and be ready to enter the bus before the bus arrives so that way you can stay on time. Operator Eames was part of a group of bus drivers polled on ways to make everyone's trip more pleasant and help keep buses running on time. It takes everyone, so next time you ride hard, be smart. Yeah.